the United States has conducted an operation that killed Osama bin Laden, the leader of Al-Qaeda, and a terrorist who's responsible for the murder of thousands of innocent men, women, and children. America's president tells the world that Osama bin Laden is dead. America's most wanted terrorist was shot by US Special Forces in Pakistan. He died during a 40-minute firefight in a town where he was hiding, about 70 miles from the capital, Islamabad. His death comes a decade after the 9-11 attacks on America, in which almost 3,000 people died. USA! 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 The news brought thousands onto the streets in Washington and New York last night. I knew we would get him eventually. I know we've worked really hard. There's no telling how much money we've spent, but it's been well worth it. I couldn't be more proud. It's been a long 10 years. I, I think everyone out here is just as emotional as I am. But there is heightened security now across the world amid warnings of reprisal attacks after bin Laden's death. Good evening. Osama bin Laden is dead. He was killed last night by American special forces. The al-Qaeda leader was shot dead after being tracked down to a heavily guarded compound north of the Pakistani capital, Islamabad. President Obama broke the news in a late-night address to the nation from the White House. He said justice had been done for the victims of the 9-11 attacks on America. As the news spread across the country, jubilant crowds gathered in Washington and in New York at Ground Zero, the site of the World Trade Center attacks. We'll be live from New York later in the program, but our first report this evening is from James Robbins.